Hello kids, boys and girls and their parents. I'm Natalia. Today is our next lesson. Вітаю вас. Я Наталія. Сьогодні наш наступний урок. You need your exercise books, your pens and pencils, your attention and a good mood. Our last lesson was about seasons. Now please guess the riddle. They are 12. They are the most disciplined and they never come one before others. What are they? Of course, they are 12 months. Їх 12. Вони найбільш дисципліновані. І вони ніколи не йдуть один перед іншими. Це, звичайно, 12 місяців. Every season has three months. They are January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, and December. Every month of the year is very interesting. We've got much to do. And now let's watch the video. Little Smart Planet presents the months of the year. January. The year starts in January, and it's very cold. You can put on your coat, your scarf, and your gloves, and go outside and make a snowman. February. February is next. It's the shortest month of the year. It's still cold, but it's also fun. In February, we celebrate Valentine's Day. March. Now March begins to be a bit warmer. It's the end of winter, and we welcome spring. Oh no! Mr. Snowman has melted. April. April is very rainy, so don't forget your boots and umbrella. Remember, Easter is in April, so look out for chocolate eggs and Easter bunnies. Next is May. In May, we are in the middle of spring, and everything is green and blooming with flowers. There are birds in trees and little animals running around. Don't you love spring? June. Summer starts in June, and so do the summer holidays. Swimming pools open, so you can go in the water, and the days are very long. July. In July, the weather is very hot. It's perfect for ice cream and for summer camp. I love summer camp. August. Next is August. It's still warm and there's still no school. Many people travel in August. Some people go to the beach and others to the mountains. But wherever you go, remember to look at the sky at night. You might see a shooting star. September. In September, the summer is over and we go back to school. That's great because you get to see your school friends again and tell each other your summer adventures. October. When October comes, it's autumn and the leaves start to fall from the trees. It's also Halloween. Prepare your scary costumes and go trick-or-treating. November. Now it's November, and it's getting colder. Days are getting shorter, and the wind is blowing stronger. So it's time to look for your scarf again. December. December is the last month of the year. It begins to snow again as we all prepare for Christmas. I love Christmas. 
And also, get ready to say goodbye to this year and wish everyone a Happy New Year. Okay. Maybe some words and expressions are very difficult for you. Можливо, деякі слова та вирази були для вас незрозумілими. Let's fix that. Давайте це виправимо. In February, we celebrate Valentine's Day. У лютому ми святкуємо День Святого Валентина. Celebrate – святкувати. For example, we celebrate Christmas in December or we celebrate Halloween in October. March begins to be a bit warmer. Березень починає бути трошки теплішим. Begins – починає. A bit – трошки. School begins in September. Or it's a bit cold in April. Mr. Snowman has melted. Mr. Sniegovik Rostanov. Melt – танути. My ice cream has melted, or sugar in the tea has melted. Remember, Easter is in April. Пам'ятайте, Великдень у квітні. Remember, пам'ятати. Remember, take your notebooks with you. Look out for chocolate eggs and Easter bunnies. Уважно шукайте шоколадні яйця та великодних кроликів. Look out for – уважно шукати. Подивимось уважніше на цей вираз. Look for – шукати. Look out – бути обережним, бути уважним. Look out for autumn leaves in your garden. Everything is blooming with flowers. Все навколо квітне. Bloom – квітнути. My garden is blooming in spring. It's perfect for ice cream and summer camp. Ідеально для морозива та літнього табору. Perfect. Ідеально. When it's cold, it's perfect to stay home. When it's rainy, it's perfect to play video games. Some people travel in August. Деякі люди подорожують у серпні. Travel. Подорожувати. We travel on holidays. You might see a shooting star. Ви можете побачити зірку, що падає. Shooting star – зірка, що падає. Українською мовою правильніше казати вмираюча зірка, дуже романтично. You can tell each other your summer adventures. Ти можеш розповісти одне одному про свої літні пригоди. Adventures – пригоди. I like reading books about adventures. Prepare your scary costumes and go trick or treating. Приготуйте свої костюми для залякування та вимагайте солодощів. Scary costumes – страшні костюми або костюми для залякування. Trick or treat. Є така традиція на Хэллоуин ходити від оселі до оселі і вимагати солодощів. Воно так і перекладається – витівка або подарунок. Wish everyone a happy new year. Побажайте одне одному щасливого нового року. Wish – бажати. I wish you good luck. А зараз ще раз уважно подивимось на назви місяців. Як вони пишуться? Червоним виділені саме ці букви сполучення, де можна припуститися помилок. January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, December. And this is your first task. Fill in the missing letters. Заповніть пропуски. Ви бачите, що назви місяців тут дещо переплутані. Будь ласка, здогадайтесь, який це місяць, і заповніть пропущені літери.
Давайте перевіримо у відповіді. May. A Y. April. A I. June. J E. July. U Y. March. A H. September. Всі букви І. August. A U. February. E U Y. October. C O E. January. J U A. November. V B E. December. C E. Сподіваюсь, ви вже вивчили нові слова і зараз зможете зрозуміти всю історію дуже добре. Будь ласка, watch the video again and fill the gaps in the sentences. Подивіться її ще раз і заповніть пропуски у реченнях. Little Smart Planet presents The Months of the Year. January. The year starts in January, and it's very cold. You can put on your coat, your scarf, and your gloves, and go outside and make a snowman. February. February is next. It's the shortest month of the year. It's still cold, but it's also fun. In February, we celebrate Valentine's Day. March. Now March begins to be a bit warmer. It's the end of winter, and we welcome spring. Oh no! Mr. Snowman has melted. April. April is very rainy, so don't forget your boots and umbrella. Remember, Easter is in April, so look out for chocolate eggs and Easter bunnies. Next is May. In May, we are in the middle of spring, and everything is green and blooming with flowers. There are birds in trees and little animals running around. Don't you love spring? June. Summer starts in June, and so do the summer holidays. Swimming pools open, so you can go in the water, and the days are very long. July. In July, the weather is very hot. It's perfect for ice cream and for summer camp. I love summer camp. August. Next is August. It's still warm, and there's still no school. Many people travel in August. Some people go to the beach, and others to the mountains. But wherever you go, remember to look at the sky at night. You might see a shooting star. September. In September, the summer is over, and we go back to school. That's great because you get to see your school friends again and tell each other your summer adventures. October. When October comes, it's autumn, and the leaves start to fall from the trees. It's also Halloween. Prepare your scary costumes and go trick or treating. November. Now it's November. And it's getting colder. Days are getting shorter, and the wind is blowing stronger. So it's time to look for your scarf again. December. December is the last month of the year. It begins to snow again as we all prepare for Christmas. I love Christmas. And also, get ready to say goodbye to this year. And wish everyone a happy new year. After watching the video, fill in the gaps. Після того, як ми подивились відео, заповніть пропуски.
І давайте перевіримо себе. Саме holiday start in June. Літні канікули починаються у червні. In December we celebrate Christmas. У грудні ми святкуємо Різдво. Prepare your scary costume in October. Приготуйте свій костюм для залякування у жовтні. We have St. Valentine's Day in February. Ми святкуємо День Святого Валентина у лютому. Everything is green and blooming in May. Все квітне у травні. Easter is in April. Великдень у квітні. The year starts in January. Рік починається у січні. And now it's time to relax and uh, guess a very uh, funny riddle. Значить, зараз час розважитись і відповісти на не дуже серйозні загадки. What is the frog's favorite year? Який улюблений рік у жабки? Leap year. Leap year – це високосний рік. А чому, ви спитаєте, жабка любить високосний рік? А тому що слово leap означає не тільки високосний, а й стрибати. А жабки у нас люблять стрибати. What is the shortest month? Який найкоротший місяць? Do you think it's February? No, May. Because it has only three letters. Це, звичайно, травень англійською May, тому що він має тільки три літери. How many months have 28 days? Скільки місяців мають 28 днів? Of course, all of them. Звичайно, всі. The story says that people like to travel in August. But I think people like traveling in all months of a year. Which places can they go? What's the best? Let's see. Ocean. 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 Island. Ostrov. Island. Mountains. Gore. Mountains. Jungle. 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 Waterfall. Water spot. Waterfall. Desert. Pustella. Desert. Forest. Leaf. Forest. Lake. Ozero. Lake. А зараз звернемо увагу на вимогу цих слів. Say it right. Кажіть це правильно. Mountain. Desert. Зверніть увагу, що в слові desert наголос припадає на перший склад. Waterfall. Lake. Jungle. Island. В слові island букву S ми не вимовляємо. Ocean. Це теж дуже складне слово. Буква С тут вимовляється Ш. Це дуже рідка вимова. Forest. Try to guess what places I'm reading about. It is smaller than the sea. A lot of fish live there. You can swim, boat or go fishing there. What is this? It's a lake. There are no trees or flowers in this place. It's boiling hot there. There are no rivers or lakes, and not many animals can live there. What place is it? It's a desert. There are many big unusual trees and beautiful flowers. This place is a home for exotic animals. It is usually hot and wet there. It's jungle. And now your turn. Ваша черга. Make your own riddle about a place you like. Складіть свою власну загадку про місце, яке вам подобається. Але для цього вам треба спочатку відповісти на такі запитання. What places do you want to visit and why? Які місця ви хочете відвідати і чому? What is the best time to visit them? Яка найкраща пора для того, щоб їх відвідати? Це і буде ваше домашнє завдання. Thank you for your hard work. Good luck and goodbye. 
Вчіть англійську із задоволенням.